do you know that not everyone in isi gets stipend i'll talk more about it in the later part of this video first of all indian statistical institute pays you stipend and contingency if you are in a mtech program the per month stipend is 12400 and apart from that you also get a yearly 8000 rupees of contingency grant which you can use it for purchasing books laptop accessories or anything which you would require to study and if you are in a masters program like msqe then you get 8000 per month stipend and 8000 per year contingency grant and if you are in a bachelor's program b stat b math you get 5000 per month stipend and 5000 per year contingency grant few people who come to iasi also tend to pursue other earning avenues in their free time like solving online assignments and part time tutoring So the amount of earnings which you can generate from these part-time tutoring and part-time online assignment solving depends obviously on the amount of time which you want to give to these activities because ultimately when you are in ISI you have to study and prepare for exams and build a bright career ahead do not come to ISI with the sole purpose of earning the stipend and other earning avenues ultimately ISI curriculum is really rigorous so you have have to really think wisely as to if you really can devote this amount of time to earning while learning yes i have found a lot of people who are smart enough in their time management skills and they end up earning a lot of money while they are studying at isi and one more reason to study at isi is that you only get stipend once you cross a minimum threshold in your semester performance So your stipend which is a fixed income which you get in ISI depends on your semester performance this is one more reason why you cannot become lazy while studying at ISI